pollinators and our gardens, birds, bees, butterflies, and more. Over 75% of our planet's plants depend on animal pollinators in order to reproduce, and the majority of those pollinators are insects. Today, there is a crisis in the pollinator populations. It is not just the bees that are dying at an alarming rate. The population crisis is affecting all pollinators. Bees, bats, birds, and butterflies have all seen a dramatic reduction in their populations over the past few decades. Healthy habitat for these important creatures has been adversely affected by farming practices, urbanization, and widespread pesticide use. Pollinators are crucial for growing vegetables, fruits, and berries. If you grow vegetables such as summer squash or tomatoes, you know that pollination is the key to getting good fruit scent. And not only do the pollinators have to transfer the pollen from the male flowers to the female flowers, but they need to do that multiple times. Without pollinators, our home gardens and small and large farms are in trouble. You can help reverse those declining numbers by planting and growing a pollinator-friendly flower garden that can help the insects survive in both rural and urban areas. Pollinator flower gardens are colorful, attractive, and bursting with life all summer long and easy to install and grow. Most flowers work well for attracting and nourishing pollinators both in full sun as well as in shade. Plant flowers in groups so that bees, particularly those that target just one flower, can get lots of pollen without expending a lot of energy when visiting one flower and the next. Grouping three or five plants together is more visually appealing in the landscape, too. Creating your own pollinator gardens will help our insect populations recover and will also be beautiful and colorful to look at and enjoy all season long. Here are the most popular and easy to grow flowers for attracting pollinators. Sunflower, Zinnia, Salvia, Cleome, Cosmos, Echinacea, Monarda, Rudbeckia, Sedum, Astilbe, Columbine, Hydrangea.